That woman called in a mother. That woman you're seeing there, like I was telling you, she's called Inamara. She's the woman who has ensured that she's the DPC of this area, but she has been giving tough orders right from night. Uh, she was saying Chabran uh, even doesn't have the time to spend any minutes here while taking fuel, and now she's taking photos. She has pulled out her phone that she can also take photos of people who are here, which is not bad, it's all right. But we are moving on. Whatever, Namara, 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 over what? I just think I'm not here to know her name and how it's pronounced. Because she even refused to tell it to us. We just read it. We just got it from somewhere. She's putting on a jacket, a black jacket, which is not even a police uniform. She's, she refused to say her name last night. So. We are headed to the rally venue in Chiangkwansi, where we shall be having the first rally of the day. Where we shall be having the first rally of the day. It's a bright morning, somber, but making everyone stronger than ever before. Alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu chotaite Hussein. Thank you. Eh, teba ina chiba wa gamba. Muri wana Uganda, te muri determined. Okchu sendera. Mm. They always do something to cut the speed of the national inter platform candidate Robert Chagulang sent um, either by diverting him to poor roads so that it takes a lot of time before reaching to the rallies. Now this is another tactic forcing him to sleep by the roadside so that by the next day he has no power and energy to campaign in the three districts. And the first tactic was to reduce the number of days without any genuine or lawful reason from the usual ones we know three months and above to 60 days. 
the very many tactics they have used and by they I mean the government in power, the authorities, the ones with authorities right now. Of course, authority has always changed hands by all means. When we were still in school, God, we used to study that you can't, if you can't change, change you'll change you. That was in uh, Christian religious education, CRE, and, and maybe in divinity, or RE. Our, our tutors used to tell us, if you can't change, change will change you, because change is a fact of life. Yes, so even those with power, those with guns, must accept to change. If they don't change, change will change them. Like Robert Yablain Sintam has already said, they always want to make him and his team look sad and miserable by tormenting them. But they will just make them... But they, they just make them annoyed instead by looking happy, by it's acting it. happy, by acting peaceful. Why? Because like Martin Luther King, Dr. Jr. said, it's only water that can put off fire. It's only good that can triumph over evil. It's only non-violence that can quell violence. And lastly, hate can only be dissolved by love. We are on Ghetto TV live here in Nigeria. We are in Ghetto TV live in Nigeria. It's a somber mood for everyone. Everyone standing by the roadside is just cold. They are just feeling so sad, especially the supporters of Robert Chiaguan Center and the National Interpart from NUP. But Chiaguan is more determined than ever before to continue with his mission. The mission he says it's a mission to freedom. It's a mission to reality. It's a mission to changing the status quo. The 34 year old status quo, which he says it has been described and defined by tyranny, dictatorship, and lawlessness. All the laws that were made in our 1995 constitution have almost been either changed in favor of the ruling regime or ignored and the security agencies and other government officials have been given a go ahead to use the laws in their own favor the selective application and enforcement of these laws is what ugandans are looking at and saying we must change leadership 35 i would say even 40 34 years, to be specific, are enough. Are enough. And all the people you have been seeing, trailing, Chagrin Sintam, waiting for him by the roadside, waiting for him and all other national platform leaders, here in Uganda and abroad, those who are always watching whatever is broadcast on all media platforms, mainstream and social media, and online, are saying this must be changed and we have the only person God has brought at this time to help us change this entire situation. You can't imagine a presidential candidate was denied access to a hotel he had booked to sleep. His entire team and entourage, plus journalists, 
slept here. Slept here. Outside. <laughs> By the roadside. <laughs> Adam Namara and her boss, the guy you see with the cap, is Namara's boss, whom she invited last night to come and help her. Okay, you want to to He is now running away because Chagulani was, was trying to tell him that these guys, having studied history, should have known. We are now setting up to Chiang Kwanji. People are just are waving like yesterday when we reached this area. People were just happy and cheering, but they're sad because they have been watching the news all night. They know what happened to the person they want to be their president. Girinya is part of the trail. Robert Chaplain Center Mu is heading to Changkwanzi for the first rally of the day. Having said bye bye to DPC Namara and her bosses.
Civilian clothed bosses covering faces and putting on caps similar to those of Museveni. 